Malapit na ang Pasko, and that means delayed deliveries. And if you're shopping for yourself or for your friends who are either techie or neat freaks like me, here are seven budget accessories below 220 pesos you can add to supplement your tech or their tech. Practically everything on this list are items I have used every day for two years, except for a couple of them which I've used for around eight months. These thus are not only really cheap things to have, but are also very practical for work and organization. Hi, I'm Rafael from Hardware Sugar, and these are the top seven budget tech accessories under 220 pesos. Windows. Windows. options, prices. CDKeyOffers.com. Madali lang ang order. Search for the software you need. Add to cart. Daan ka sa payment options nila. Wala pang 5 minutes. Finished! May legit working CD key ka na para sa Windows mo. Gamitin lang aming code para makakuha pa ng discounts. Kaya kung naghahanap ka ng legit, mura, at original software, Check out cdkeyoffers.com the first item on our list is the Top K Cable Organizer. This is probably my favorite item on the list, mostly because of how it makes me feel good when I use them. These are Velcro rolls which at first remind you of a roll of tape. Like tape, you can roll out as much as you need and then cut it off with scissors. Unlike tape, however, you can keep reusing these over and over again because it is Velcro and not reliant on an adhesive, which is very good for the environment. The problem with double-sided tape is that once you remove it from a surface, it's practically going to need to be replaced sooner or later. Velcro, on the other hand, will take years of constant removal before you need to replace it. I've only had to buy these once, and I haven't had the need to buy a new set since because I already just keep reusing what I already have cut off. You can use this to cable manage practically everything. I use them to help control the wires on my desk, behind my desk, and even the lamp and chargers at my bedside. For 69 pesos, this is a steal, and you can just keep the roll in your drawer for whenever you need to cut more. Magnets. I bought these miniature magnets for our aircon remote in the kitchen. As much as possible, I avoid drilling holes in walls and applying adhesive hooks to walls, mostly because both will ruin your wall when you need to remove them. My solution was to buy these magnets, which come in various sizes. The magnets come with their own adhesive strips, which at least attaches to the item and not the wall, so you don't need to worry about removing the paint off the wall. Now, the air corner mode clings to my fridge, no problem. I mention this because NZXT sells a popular puck, which you can attach to your PC case where you can hang your headset. I'm not sure what you may want to hang, to be honest, onto your PC case. Maybe artwork or other accessories which don't have magnets. In any case, what I like about this and some of the items on this list is that it gives you a lot of freedom to be imaginative. Let me know in the comment section below what you would use these magnets for. These magnets are priced at 157 pesos. There are a lot of magnet choices to choose from and make sure you get enough for what you need. I got enough magnets for it to stick to my fridge, but apparently that's not enough if you want to stick it to your PC. Adjust accordingly, guys. Top K Cable Organizer. I absolutely hate looking at wires. What I hate more about wires is not knowing where I left my charger or having to get the cable which has fallen behind the table or whatever. I hate having to think where to bring my device to charge. With the Top K Cable Organizer, I can see all my cables front and center. I have thus made two charging stations in my room, one at the side of my bed and the other at the other side of my room. You don't need to use this organizer as a charging station because it essentially is just an organizer for wires, but it seems to be the most practical first choice on how to use these. It comes with the adhesive strip and I have never had to change it. Some people said before when I started using this that there is a risk that it will damage the cables. None of my 10 cables have been damaged yet and it's been close to two years already. For 94 pesos, this adds so much class and order to my room, and most importantly, saves time and money. A versatile cell phone holder. Everyone sort of needs to have a cell phone holder nowadays to either attach to the mini tripod or an actual tripod. 
However, most people always just settle for the static maneuverable version. This one priced at 191 pesos allows for full 360 degree turns. It gives you the option to move it around at will even when the phone has already been mounted on it. You can choose to lock it in place by screwing in the back. However, it does its job so well that I never need to do this extra step. In general, I just like how maneuverable it makes my phone and it is a step up from the standard tripod. This is important if you're a content creator creating shorts who need portrait mode or landscape mode for regular videos or hell if you just want to FaceTime your family. This microfiber cleaning cloth looks almost like the 1,190 pesos cloth that Apple sells. I don't ever plan to own any of those. However, this one which just costs 71 pesos for five pieces is a really great deal. It arrives with each of them wrapped up in plastic and before you say that that's expensive for a piece of cloth or you might ask if you really need them, let me tell you that I have one in my pocket always, either at home or outside the house. My biggest use for them is my glasses and my cell phone. I have tried using these much cheaper microfiber cloths in the past and I tell you that they suck. They not only don't get rid of the dirt on my glasses but they also have scratched them. I'll never use these to clean my phone or my monitor ever. These, however, are really smooth, feel premium, and you can really tell that these are the microfiber cloths meant to take care of your tech gear. I have bought 20 of these, and after 16 months, all of them are perfectly fine, despite me having washed them over and over. Sometimes you don't want to always have to use your phone or tablet or whatever gadget to set an alarm because you end up getting sidetracked with an email or some other notification. This magnetized digital alarm with kickstand is perfect for basic and useful timers. Costing only 72 pesos, you can buy one for your room and one for your kitchen, which is what I did. And you'll notice that you'll be burning less food and having a less greasy cell phone. Because really, do you want to hold your phone after slicing up raw meat? Or even want it around when hot oil is splattering all over the place? For me, a dummy timer which does its job helps place me in the zone of a single act without the noise of one more notification. The alarm is also handy for performing work. I've been doing Pomodoro lately in which you allocate a specified amount of time to a single task without being bothered at all. It is recommended you do one hour away from your phone so that you get the task done and then when you're on your break, you can check your notifications. The problem is that if your phone is the alarm, you'll be tempted to check it. 72 pesos is a very small price to pay for being more productive and feeling more fulfilled at the end of the day. I am a cable organizer fiend. I have tried regular adhesive hooks and they just don't work. They come apart after a month or so and then you need to replace them all over again. I hated it. My solution was this gray plastic cable duck which starts at 199 pesos. You need to buy your own mounting tape as it does not come with adhesives. This is the mounting tape I used. Note that mounting tape is meant to be permanent, so it's touch move for the most part. I did a video on how I installed this at the back of my desk, which I'll place up above. I want to report that I have seen no problems whatsoever ever since I attached it. This has a really ingenious design. It has holes so that you can pull out the wire needed based on where you need it to come out from. Like in my desk, my speaker wire is just too short if it were to come out from the same space where my keyboard wire enters. After you place the cables inside the organizer, by the way, the adhesive straps mentioned at the start of the list really help here. All you need to do is slide the lid over it to keep everything shut. Unlike other weird cable organizers where once a wire is in, it is really hard to get it out, like this one, don't bother with this one at all. As a tech enthusiast, I am surprised by how excited I get over gear which doesn't have any RGB. And the best part is that these are inexpensive items which solve everyday problems. The reason why this isn't a top 10 list is simply because I only have 7 items within this price range. I am very proud of these 7 items in particular and I can personally vouch for them since I bought and used them for a year or more. I bought all of them from Shopee Philippines, however, if you prefer to buy from Lazada, feel free to just look for the same buyer from there. I'll leave the links to all of these in the video description below. Paminsan may nagtatanong kung may kilala ba kaming computer shop na trusted yung hindi ka lolokohin. Actually, meron. Kami. Full service PC store ang Hardware Sugar. Nagbabenta kami ng PC components. Nagbabenta rin kami ng fully assembled rigs. We clean computers. Kasama na rin yung excellent cable management namin and CPU cooler repasting sa cleaning. 
we also clean and repaste GPUs. Nasa Makati yung physical store namin and you can also buy from our site www.hwsugar.ph na 100% palaging up to date yung inventory dun. Kung in stock yung item sa amin, available yun sa site. We also ship nationwide. Thanks for watching and maybe one of these days magkita tayo sa shop.